My name is Mark Szanowski and I've been involved in English language teaching, ELT, for 20 years. When you study a language or a specific register or a variety of it, jargon is that stage of a learning cycle where you deal with something unfamiliar, something which may be completely incomprehensible to you. But as you go along, you seem to move on a continuum from jargon towards the process when jargon suddenly at some stage becomes something very natural, very familiar. The academic person that I most admire is probably Bob Jordan. I remember him writing the very first book, an academic writing course in 1977. And the lifespan or the life, shelf life of books can be actually quite short. Some of them get dated very soon, but this particular book is still in print today. I've taught English, for example, in South Africa, in Cuba and in Yemen. Various courses in South Africa, it was a teacher training course at Hornby Summer School for the British Council where I taught uh, 28 teachers from eight sub-Saharan African countries. In Yemen, I ran a teacher training course for 48 teachers in the post-16 vocational sector. And in Cuba, I taught university lecturers, most of them based in uh, Cuban medical schools. All these three experiences were, well, shall I say, transformed my life. Some people ask me sometimes, what is your secret tip for effective teaching? I would say maybe three things, maybe five. Namely, creation of a memorable context, if you're able to do so, there is a guarantee that learners will actually learn and there will be a high information transfer afterwards. Another key to success would be energizing the classroom, for example, through varied patterns of classroom interaction, particularly kinesthetic activities. Another important point is creation of a conducive learning and teaching environment in which you have a caring and sharing environment where the teacher and the students actually feel at ease and probably the last point to be remembered please do not ignore this one is humor because there is that humor things become more meaningful